All righty then. Um, I recently acquired this Fisher Futura for $20. Um, as you can see, cabinet wise is a bit of a mess, but there's something, there's something I think underneath this that can be saved, hopefully. So that's why I'm going to do this video in parts because it, there might be a massive fail on this because I'm going to do some cabinet work that I've never done before. Um, there was a big plant pot stain here. So what I did was I just sanded this spot right here. Although everything will have to be sanded eventually, but this was the worst. I wanted to see what was underneath, had it penetrated the veneer, and it has slightly. Um, I've been talking to good people on the uh, refinishing group in Facebook, and also my good friend in Phoenix, uh, Mike K, has given me some great tips about doing oxalic acid, which I've never done before. So this is why I'm going to do this in parts. Um, saving this $20 Fisher because it's a Futura. It's quite iconic look. There are cabinet issues here and there. There's some veneer chip there that I can deal with. But um, if I can get it working, this is way salvageable. Now when I say get it working is the guy said, before we put it in its garage, it worked. I've heard that so many times, but anyway, there's no power whatsoever coming through. Um, the fuses are good. There's AC coming out of the uh, What's it ports, you know the plug the uh, what do you call them the hookup ports? Uh, socket says AC, but there's no DC whatsoever. It's not firing up um, And this is a hybrid it really really sounds nice when they're working. I've got a funny feeling Just a funny one. It's the automatic shut off is stuck because it won't go it's all the way to the off position. So if automatic is on, even though I disconnect that, um, nothing's happening. But like I said, I've got to pull it, I've got to check it, and if all things go to plan, then I'll continue with the wood. Um, if it doesn't, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with her. Um, but anyway, this is part one. Uh, stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching.